The Auburn Tigers take the field here at Ch Charles Schwab Field. These two teams met once late May, and Arkansas took two out of three from them. It was a factor last night, it's a factor again tonight. First pitch, gap shot. That's going to get down. And instead of giving up a single on the first pitch, Mason Barnett gives up a double. Braden Webb starting us off hot. Right down Broadway and laced back up the middle. Waved in his web. Here comes the throw off the top of the mound. And the move of Peyton Stovall to the two hole pays off immediately. Dave Van Horn has to have a smile on his face right now. Rightfully so, man. Sonny D, the co-SEC player of the year, and they're going to face an arm that they haven't seen a whole lot of. Not a lot have seen a whole lot of. Will McIntyre, the right-handed sophomore, had a big-time start against North Carolina. McIntyre. He won't get that. Moore will charge and fire to first. That's Robert Moore, the second baseman. We have a very good NCAA tournament, hitting 438. Oh. That one did not miss by much. Wow, ball oh, four, goodness. McIntyre. One and two on the ground battles. Looks like he's going to try it himself. Say out at second base, double play. They may want to take a look at that. It certainly looked like Moore slid in before battles got there. But the second base umpire, Dave Hyman, said he was out, which would be a double play, and yeah. he is spot on. What a play. Yeah, I just, what really disappoints me about Jalen Battles is he's not athletic. <laughs> he's so boring to watch play shortstop. I mean, he's only got one chance on this because they're pinched up the middle and, and into the... You have to be ready for any one of four anytime. There's a strikeout. That's number one for Will McIntyre. I want, I want the ball. Good pitch right over the top. 88, deceptive, and it's another punch out. That was a foul ball. Into yeah. the glove, it was. He knew it. He sold it, and as you guys have said all week, trust the hitter. 3-2 left field. Bello blocked by that. He had no idea. And that time, the cloud had disappeared. You can see the sun is back. And Bello could not see it. Stovall is aboard with a sun-aided single. You worked yourself out of it. Huh? Three and two. Here we go. And that's ball four. You're on a high fly. Stovall will be running. And if it can't be caught, then we'll have trouble. Pass Sonny Deshera charging his peer. Stovall coming in. Throw home offline. Good speed. Great read by Peyton Stovall. Man, Arkansas has got a 2-0 lead. Looks like a big pitch for Barnett. 3-2, and this one to left, and into the corner it's going. It's a tough play. He can't see it. It's off the ground and up against the wall. Fielded there. One run is going to score. Second run is in. A two-run double for Robert Moore. And the Hogs have opened up a 4-0 lead. He's just pitching all over the place. All over the place in a very good way. You just can't sit there and have any decent idea what you're going to get. All right, five in a row huh. for Will McIntyre as he punches out Nate LaRue. It's the hardest pitch yep. today is. Fair point. Bellow's not one of them. No. He's a little <laughs> blooper into right. No, <laughs> Two spot by Dave Van Horn. I don't think he's going to come out of that two spot. How about that? Waited on it and sent it right down the line past Rambush. You cannot get Peyton Stovall out right now. He's three for three and adds a double to the resume tonight. What a move. Right field and deep. Going back is Pierce. He's still going back. Looking up, but it's high off the wall. Into second base, sliding. Safe with a double. Two more runs come in. It's Michael Turner, and it is six to nothing, Arkansas. They're not going to challenge the play. And Lanzilli hammers this to left field. You may not have to see it. Bello has no idea. It wouldn't matter. That ball is long gone. Home run, Lanzilli. Two run shot, eight nothing, Arkansas rolling. 
Cervello could have fallen down. He could have put the glove mm. over his face. It didn't matter, but he had no idea where it was. Uh, that poor kid left. Just, he flat cannot yeah. see it. He literally had his glove up in the air like he was trying to catch it when it landed in the stands. The thing is, where he stands, there's no way. But watch this. Slider just hung. He's looking at it to see how far it's going to go, if it's going to stay fair or not. But just hung it. Look at, Look at Bello. Watch, watch Bello. He has no idea. Look at it at the end. No idea. Goes to Matt Hobbs, pitching coach for Arkansas, and says, how am I supposed to get some time if you don't give me a chance? So Matt Hobbs goes to Dave Van Horn's office and says, what do you think we should do? Same bird that almost got David Weathers. There you go. Sonny Deshera delivers. A lace shot into left first hit of the game for Auburn. And the second hit of the College World Series for the co-SEC player of the year. Mm, another strikeout. That's number seven. Does give up the first hit of the night. But McIntyre. Did you say that we have his eat pad? I don't need these. Oh. McIntyre, another strikeout. He's got eight. It's not with 98. Battles is not going to get that. It's going to drop. That's a hit for Kaysen Howell. We're getting close to 20. Fair point. Yep. There's there you 20. go. There's 20. Got to find the ball. It's at his feet. Now he does. And that's a tough throw. Right over the head of Nate LaRue. It's all going well for Arkansas. Arkansas raises back bobblehead ball. There you go. Line shot. That's past Rambush. And this is going to be a Caden Wallace extra base hit. First hit of the night. He's aboard with a double. In that position, you feel about as good as you can. It's going to be a tough play. Up the middle, it gets through into center field. There's another tack on run. Wallace comes in. Turner with a topspin single up the middle. His second hit picks up RBI number three on the night. You smile? No. <laughs> the other way, that's through. Good piece of hitting. Lanzilli having a great night. And a throw into third on a wide turn by Turner. You don't. It was a hard stop after twice. Uh -oh. Swinging bunt. Who's it first? Sonny D gets back and he flips it late, but they do it in time to get him. Two times in your life. You've done it more. Oh, what a play. Willie Mack have a day. Kid's going to win a gold glove tonight, too. <laughs> Rear high and strikeouts. His third put out. Let a ball go past him. Okay, so six balls. And that was in the first inning. There's been one fly ball out. That fly ball may be out. It stays fair, and it is a home run for Bobby Pierce. The only question was, would it stay there? And it was tracking towards the foul pole, but it stayed inside it. And Bobby Pierce picks up his 10th home run of the year and the first run for Auburn. Coming inside, that pitch missed by a ton. Oh, Look at man. Battle stay down on it and fire to first to get Brooks Carlson. Yeah. I oh, <laughs> wait a second. Just want to make sure it doesn't negatively affect you. Yeah, he can do that too, by the way. So the whole Ford shortstop on the infield thing, when they do, this happens. Caden Wallace, glove side, kind of tackles him just to make sure then plenty of arm strength to throw across. That's seven in the books, and the Hogs lead at 9-1. Tournament from a hotel room in Minnesota. And there's a hard hit ball, and Peyton Stovall, for the fourth time tonight, reaches base with a hit. This is games that way. This is fine. Look out. Yep, that's into the corner. Cut off, watch the throw here to third. Oh! On him. He's, uh, nope, punched out. No, the glove stayed on him. Looked like he just came off, and I think the glove stayed on the foot. Yes. The glove what a throw. Yeah. What a call. That's a great he call. Got yeah. he, he got him on the foot when the hand came off the bag, it appears. Zebulon Vermillion. One of the many parts out of this Arkansas bullpen, and See if they get the last six outs with Vermillion or try to split it up, go three and three. And oh, he snared it.
fires to first. The defense <laughs> so has been unbelievable. Robert Moore, he was going to his right, <laughs> and the ball took a hard left. He's got to start laughing after this, Eddie. High hop. No more high hops. The kicks to his left. Talk about having a great balancing act. He has it. Hog call if he can ever be found. Another one. He's going to get it. Show yes, off. sir. <laughs> Show it off now. Four pitches. We all need more. Series being realized. All right, hit on the ground, and that's under the glove of Foster. And Moore picks on his fellow second base roots of an inning. And they rolled through seven pitchers. Nope. Five hits. A rocket into right field. Here's that armor pierce to home, and Battles beats it. A five-hit night for Peyton Stovall. He picks up his fourth single. He's nine for 16 in the College World Series. Have a night. Austin Ledbetter, the freshman, will come in. Arkansas is loaded with regards to having played so many days in a row. Yeah, yeah that's not on the right. On the ground, battles. Smooth. All right, let's see Sonny ride one out of here. Oh, mm, back up the middle, ouch. There's the West. Rocket could be two. Fielded cleanly, battles to first. And wouldn't you know it, a web gem by Moore, and that thing was scalded. And he and Battles continue to perform miracles up the middle. How fitting. Again, the defense up the middle has been phenomenal the entire series, the entire season. What a class act right there by Sonny D. Giving hugs. But this defense, man, if you're going to win ball games, you can't give away runs, and they don't. They get outs. Now that was running in there pretty hot. Arkansas will face Ole Miss. Trying to stay alive tomorrow night at 7 o'clock.